Okay, George, to record your eye opening, I will check whether you can open your eyes without any stimulation. To record the verbal response, I will ask you three questions. Who are you? Where are you? And what date, month and year it is. If you answer all the three questions correctly, that means you are oriented. If any one of the questions is answered incorrectly, that means you are confused. And in that case, I will reorient you. To check the best motor response, I will ask you to squeeze and release my fingers and I will check both your arms. To check the size of your pupil, I will ask you to look straight and I will obstruct the light from above. I will just look into your eyes to check the size of your pupil. To record the reaction of your pupil, I will be shining a light uh, from the outer corner towards outer corner of the eye towards the pupil and the and also I will withdraw it. So your pupil should constrict when the light is shone and it should immediately dilate when the light is withdrawn. Now that means uh, that shows your pupils are reacting. To record the strength of your arms, I will ask you ask you to lift both your arms. I will apply pressure from above, you need to resist it. To record the strength of your legs, I will lift both your legs and you need to resist it. Now uh, regarding vital signs, so to record the blood pressure, first I will check your airway. So I will ask you to open your mouth uh, and I will check for any visual obstructions. And regarding breathing, I will check your respiratory rate for one full minute by counting the rise and fall of your chest. Along with that, I will check the rhythm and depth of your respiration. Also, I will check for use of accessory muscle. I will listen to respiratory noises. I will look for any sweating, cyanosis or seizure breathing. And also, I will check the chest movement uh, to make sure that there is equal air entry on both your lungs. And also, I will check your capillary refill by pressing the tip of your nail bed for 5 seconds. After 5 seconds, I will release it and the normal refill is 2 seconds or less. So, if, it is, uh, the, if the refill time is good, that means the perfusion is good. I will also check for any pallor. And on the same finger where I check the, saturate, uh, check the capillary refill, I will check the saturation drop by attaching the sat spread on the finger. So I'll check the saturation by attaching the sat spread on the same finger. And uh, I will be recording your blood pressure. I will check your preferred arm for any infection inflammation. This flower cannula, I'll make sure there is no surgery on that side. I'll take the correct blood pressure cuff. I'll place it 2 to 3 cm above your brachial artery. When the cuff gets inflated, you will feel some tightness and you need to let me know if it is too uncomfortable. Uh, and also, I will record the pulse rate. I will count your radial pulse by placing two fingers on your radial, on your wrist. I will count the pulse for one full minute. Along with that, I will check the strength and rhythm of your pulse. And uh, through our conversation, uh, I will come to know whether you are alert or not. And also, I will I will be checking your blood sugar. I will ask for any like. Uh, uh, urine output. So, is your urine output okay? Yes. Okay. Any pain? Do you have any pain anywhere? No. Okay. Uh, uh, do you, what's your recent blood sugar? It's 4.6. 4.6. Okay. That's really good. Okay. And I will be recording your temperature. Uh, I'll be using a tympanic thermometer which goes into your ear. Um, uh, and after that, I will discard the probe in the clinical waste bin. Okay. Uh, do you have any bruises, bleeding or injuries anywhere? No. Okay. Uh, can you please tell me about your past medical history? Uh, there is no past medical history. Okay. Uh, so that's fine. Thank you very much. So, um, okay, I need to record uh, everything now. Is it okay? Yes. I'm taking the flash card and I'm going to record it. Alright George, your GCS score is 14. Uh, 
I'll be escalating this to the doctor and I'll be monitoring you every 30 minutes. Is that okay? Yes. 